Okay, so um, this is my second and last wholesale seven haul, as far as I can tell. Um, in this haul, I finally got the um, two swimsuits that initially made me even find wholesale seven. Um, I have it in an orange and large, uh, medium and late blue. Um, I also got a swimsuit cover-up in a rose red, large. It's very similar to those matte collection ones. Honestly, it probably is a matte collection one. Also, I got a, a crop in medium that's black. It's like a cute little crisscross bag on it. And then I also got a um, pair of denim jeans with like yellow um accents but appearing in this bag they look more neon green and yellow but semantics um so as you can see wholesale seven kind of sends it in these ziploc bags um not too different from shein but shein has like actual um uh, branding on theirs so what i can say is the comparison between this shipment and the first shipment in Wholesale 7, um, it's different. The packaging is different. It's not uniform. Um, so I would assume that one, these are probably coming from different places, different warehouses. Um, and there's no um, standard way that they're gonna come. Um, but I do prefer the way these came in the first batch I got from them. But, uh, yeah, and it comes in like a regular envelope, so there's nothing really snazzy about it at all. Uh, so, let's try some stuff on. Okay, so this first two items are from Wholesale 7. Um, the bottom is a contrast color. Um denim short in yellow uh it's a large so the yellow kind of looks more like neon green in person also um i don't like how loose it is around the thigh part like it's like i got a large and i need more of a substantial thigh to feel out the pants the way you want to feel it out in the leg portion. Um, the medium, I might have been able to do a medium, but I think it would have been a little too tight because it's kind of fitted in the fullest part of the hip. Um, so the, the way they look online, I like. And I like the ideal of them, but actually on, I don't love it. Um, the jean does not have stretch in it, so don't depend on that. Um, so, unfortunately, the return process for Wholesale 7 is a pain. And um, I'm not going to return them because of that. Uh, I'll post the price of how much they were. They were cheap, relative-wise. So I might see if a friend can fit them or something, but I don't see myself wearing these. Um, the top is a black crop um, with like an open back on it. It was real cute on the website. I don't hate it. Like, I don't like that this doesn't fit. I don't like that this doesn't fit my neck all the way. Um, but it could get some play. And I'm sure I didn't spend more than $10. Maybe it was eight something. It can get some play. Of course, uh, it's probably a medium. And of course, it's one of those situations where you'll either have to wear tape or something but you know this is a no bra situation so 
This is my first, and no, I did not buy these to go together, but I put them on together for the sake of this video. Okay, so this next item is the Sexy Perspective Sleeveless um, Maxi Dress. Um, I forget which color I went with, um, or what they call the color, but I'll post it. Anyway, I think this dress was probably about, mm, about six, six dollars and fifty cent. Um, it looks very much like that maxi collection dress, which honestly, this is probably where they order it from, Wholesale 7. Um, I love it. Um, right now I have on an orange Fashion Nova Libra swimsuit underneath, but um, I love this one. This uh, cover up, they're calling it a maxi dress. I use it as a cover up. I love it. I mean, granted, could you put on some underwear and wear this out? I mean, if that's your thing, you absolutely could. Um, but it fits nice. Um, I think I probably got a large. No Definitely idea. got a large. Um, but you know, it's a little stretch. And it looked good on the beach. So this was a win. Okay, so the next item is a sexy hollow out one piece bodysuit with skirt. Okay, so this is the item that led me to Wholesale 7. This is literally it in orange. This is the color I wanted. It was a girl on Instagram selling it. I thought it was so cute. I had to have it. I wanted it for my vacation. Um, it did come before I could leave my vacation, but I decided to leave it behind for a couple reasons. One. Um, this is a large, and honestly, I think a large is too big for me. Um, you can see this is very loose, okay? Um, also, the lady on Instagram was presented as a swimsuit, but it's very much so had more like it's like as a top. It doesn't have that swimsuit feel, it doesn't have the lining in it. Um, if you just kind of on the beach chilling, I think you get away with it. But I think if you get in the water with this, um, it's going to leave nothing to the imagination. Um, also, I would show you it without the skirt, but I'm not, um, because the back is very much so a thong situation, um, but weird, like maybe yeah no so anyway the skirt is needed in my case um and in a lot of people's cases honestly unless you want to wear out then that, that's your business um it's cute still um i would probably if i was gonna wear it as a swimsuit it would be like when you're going to the beach and you're chilling you're not getting in the water. You just laying out, just look trying to look cute. Um, but definitely a large is too big for me. Also, I don't like the cut of it. It's a very high cut. I don't enjoy a high cut on anything such as this. The cut is way up high. So, um. It's probably like eleven dollars. I'm not sending it back. Like I said, wholesale seven is not easy on the in the on the return side. So I'm gonna keep it. I don't know. Maybe give it away to somebody who could wear large. But then I don't know if this was a large. It's just it's just not what I thought it was. And I can't even blame wholesale seven. I blame the girl on Instagram who was selling it for way more than it cost on wholesale seven. But anyway, this is it in orange. I also have it in another color and medium, which I'm gonna try on next. 
Okay, so this next one is the Sexy Hollow Out One Piece Body Suit, but in lake blue in a size medium. Okay, so take back what I said about me um, needing a medium. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe a small might be better. I'm honestly not sure. I think a small would be worse. This just, I'm just not that comfortable in this. Um, it's going to take some work for me to wear this wherever I think I'm going to. But um, again, I can tell that it's smaller. Um, it, it does fit a little bit better up top, but I still feel a little exposed. Um, uh, also, again, this skirt is very much so needed. Cannot be taken off because um, there is no coverage in the back. Also, the high cut on this medium is real high. Like, you need to be um, waxed if you're going to wear it without the skirt on. Um, but, girl, I, I still think it's cute. Don't get me wrong. It's cute. It's just not what I thought it was. I really thought it was a swimsuit. Like a true blue swimsuit. And I was just like, oh, this little skirt thing is cute. Um, the girl on Instagram will wear the skirt part in the front. And they also do in the pictures. The way the situation is, I got to turn it to the side. So, um... I mean, for eleven dollars. I mean, I'm not sending it back. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Where I'm gonna wear it to? Maybe Miami. I could wear this in Miami. Just bouncing around. Um, Vegas in the summer. Something like that. But you know, so this is wholesale seven. Um, I'd have to say. Uh, I'm probably not going to order from Wholesale 7 again. I had a very mixed bag experience. Um, and when I did try to return some stuff, they only gave me 35% of what I spent on it. But they didn't make me send it back. But the two things, of the two things I returned. And it started out as a negotiation only. and I got it to 35%. One of them I wouldn't wear at all. The other one I think the wear. items would pretty so, much have to be defective for you to, to get that. your full yes. money back. But, uh, it is what it is. So wholesale seven, I'd say proceed with a lot of caution. Okay. And the last thing I have from the wholesale seven haul is the, uh, decorative eye frames um i saw these i thought these were cute um i took them on vacation i got some cute shots in them they're definitely different which a lot of times i like to do something a little different so these were cute i think they might have been three bucks just they're really something for like a, maybe a photo shoot or something you know just something a little interesting Obviously, they're not sunglasses. You're not blocking nothing from the sun. It's just something different to put on when you're trying to be different. So, happy with them. Um, we'll be wearing them. Don't know where, but I'm going. So, anyway. Ooh. Ooh, what's real good?